<clears throat> Welcome back, everybody, to Resident Evil Part 3. Let's continue this, shall we? Last place we were meant to go was the main library. Not the library. The, um, nom 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 nom. The main hall. Because we got the access key card now. Which you got really early in scenario one, but in this one you did not. I mean, it's hard as a tiny bit. You won't notice the hiring, but I will. Okay. Oh, jeez, we're really messed up. What did I do last time? I should really look back and find out. Oh, yeah. No. Once we get the key card going, we can actually move around this place freely. I hope, anyway. Yes. Voila. That's nice. Oh yeah, and I found out this handy little thing as well for moving around places. You just want to see this? See this? This is the frame limiter. And what this does, it moves it from 60 to uh, roughly around 200, 300, like this. See? Haha! Backtracking will be easier. I won't use it, I'm only kidding. I might though if I get annoyed enough. I probably would. Maybe. Safe room. Holy! Why is he in here? This is a safe room! Ugh. Oh, he sounds different too. Is this like one of these pre-beta zombies? Wow. He actually looks pretty awesome. No clothes or anything. Uh-oh. Nah. Okay. Oh, okay, there's more of you. Why is there s Well, okay. Please memorandum. random. Oh, this has the... 2236. Okay. So that's for the safe. And the safe should have the map to the police station. And I missed, apparently. Okay. That's fine. It's only one more zombie. I was really wondering, why did they never actually put zombies in safe rooms? It would've been cool if they actually added it into a- another one! It added it into a cinematic. And he's not dead. I should probably move away. really wish I knew I was messed up. Did I get into a fight with liquors the last time? What did I do? Okay. You better be dead. What's this- hold on, this thing popping up my desktop. Okay. Anyway. Can I use this? Yes, I will. I know I have. Oh, shotgun shells. Just what I needed. I don't need them now, but... With that big creepy guy following us around, who knows what we're gonna need. No. Last time I checked, there's nothing of use in here. Hold on. There we go. Makes it a little bit faster. Okay. So, we've practically nothing in here. Hmm... I think we can manage to- I'm gonna put away the herb. I, I know I've, like, a little bit of health, but we'll come across some more. I can guarantee that. Is that liquor here again? Nice, oh, it's probably already outside. Then again, if I do remember, isn't this meant to be where... This is meant to be before Claire enters. Oh. Oh, there's no liquor. But this guy's dead. Where's the liquor? When- Shouldn't we be here for when the liquor comes in? S does he still have ammo? Yeah, he does. Sweet. Hmm. You know, since I picked up ammo there, does that mean there shouldn't be any ammo next time? I'm just thinking that. I hope there's no enemies in here. This is a. This is gonna get weird. Information. Yep, still here. Yeah, it's the same thing as the last one. Yep, we have to look for those. Right, still have to look for those. There's ammo. Some C4 and all the other stuff. Speed this up. See? <laughs> Tell me if you guys don't actually like me messing with the frame rate just to speed things up. I just thought it was helpful to be honest. No. Just for like small rooms like this where we know there's nothing of relevance in them. <laughs> Why not? Sure. Okay. Yeah. Wouldn't have found it easier. More pleasant, really. Kool Aid. There we go, there's one herb. <laughs> I'm sure we'll find more in our journey. You know, if we don't, I'm... I don't know. I thought wrong, I suppose. I assumed wrong. I don't really know. Oh, oh crap! Oh my god. Um, right, I'm gonna have to deal with these. I have to go in there and get that jewel. Come on. Oh, come on, did I reload? If he bites me, I swear to Christ. There we go. Oh, he's still alive. This is the worst camera angle ever. 
I don't think he's dead, but I know he is. Ah, I can kind of see his blood. It's very transparent. Though. Let's speed this up a little bit. No. Oh, it should be ammo in here. Here we go. Give us some of that. They'll love me some handgun bullets. I'm actually going to try to use those more often, too. We had so many at the end. Forgot how Leon had this. And voila. It seems like it's going at the same speed. It's actually going... You can read on the top. It's going 100 frames. That's only because my laptop is terrible. That's also why the sound is probably muffling in with a hissing sound. I'll hopefully have it fixed by putting it through gold wave. Yes, I know the chief is a bit sketchy. And the place has been overrun. You guys can read over that. It's basically talking about the liquor and how we just encountered it. Well, we didn't encounter it in this playthrough, but in the previous one we did, you see. It's very simple enough to follow. It's a Resident Evil game. Nothing's ever complicated to follow. I'm actually getting a little nervous now. I mean, I've played this once, which was two years ago. I mentioned it earlier on, in an ep I think it was a part back or two. But it was very vague. I just said two years, and I'm pretty sure people were actually a little confused with that. I'll take one. Pretty sure people were a little confused, thinking, what are you talking about? You're crazy. Your Irish accent means nothing to me. But yeah, two years ago is the last time I'd done this playthrough. Not playthrough, well, you get the idea. Last time I played this game. There was ammo. Um, here we go. Last time I went through this part. Or scenario, sorry. My special key was not outside either for that locker over there. We could have changed Leon's costume. And it would he would have been wearing a tank top, and he aims his pistol in a certain fashion. And he also shoots a tiny bit faster doing so. It's very helpful, to be honest. Um, and a report. Same thing as always, guys. You freeze and give it a read, if you're curious. There we go. Still not in there. Useful room, as always. Fantastic. We actually have a lot of handgun rounds. I can see, I can see us using those though, unfortunately, with that big dude walking around. I might, you know, I'm sick of calling him Mr. X. I mean, why? Who the hell named him Mr. X? That's not actually his name, by the way. That's just a, kind of a, the title people put, bestowed upon him because he was 